Hello and welcome. This is DC, and yes, I am going to try my hand at Let's Plays. I have always wanted to do this. I've just been dragging my feet on it and looking for the right game, and honestly, I can't think of a better title than Hellblade Senuous Sacrifice. I've been watching the trailers for this, I've been watching gameplay videos for it, it blows me away. I mean, everything, the graphics, the motion capture, the uh, the background music, the, um, the binaural audio, uh, the story, I mean, it feels like such a polished AAA title, but it's not, I mean, it is polished, but it's not a AAA title, it's a, uh, it's actually a budget title. Uh, you can get it for $30 on Steam right now, uh, not even a sale price. Um, I'm honestly, I'm kind of surprised. I would totally pay full price for this, uh, but you know, whatever. Uh, it It's everything that I've seen of it, it just looks absolutely gorgeous. Um, it's a, a dark uh, uh, sort of story and, uh, well, you'll see, you'll see. Um, there's a lot of talking in it. Um, you'll see why in a little bit here. Um, so I actually won't be providing quite so much commentary, uh, but uh, I'll do my best to fill the silence. I, by nature, I'm just not really a motor mouth, so it's kind of difficult for me to just keep talking and, and talking. So there will be times when I'm not going to be saying anything, especially if I, if I have to concentrate. And there's uh, apparently there's a um, puzzles in the game along with combat uh, and that might take some of my time as well but anyway all right moving on so here we are my first let's play Hellblade Senuous Sacrifice so let's jump in here we go Hello. Hi. Who are you? DC. Doesn't matter. Oh, I'm sorry. Welcome. You're safe with me. Mm, it's good to I'll know. I'll be right here. Nice and close so I can speak without alerting the others. Let me tell you about Senua. Her story has already come to an end, but now it begins anew. Um, your separate head is breathing. It's breathing. It's breathing. It's breathing. He knows she's getting closer. God, this game is gorgeous. She's getting closer. This is a journey deep into darkness. There'll be no more stories after this one. What is she doing? Why is she doing this? She's there watching. Why isn't she doing coming? She's doing this for him. She wants to rescue him. He's all alone. I can feel you coming. Shh. Coming. Quiet. Oh, how rude of me. I never told you of the others. Hmm. You hear them too, right? They've been around ever since the tragedy. Oh, that's not quite true. Some are old, some are new, but they've changed. I think the darkness changed them just like it changed her. Mm. Can you see them? Yes, I do. You promised you can. Yes. It is real after all. She's finally arrived in the land of mist and fog. The place the Northmen call hell. Yeesh. It's like some sort of dragon porcupine hybrid. It's not safe.
So yeah, as you can see, or as you can hear rather, uh, Senua hears voices. Um, Look around and you will see them. The drowned, the sick, the slain. Here they lie, rotting in the fields and rivers of hell. But the dead don't always lie still here. But yeah, um, I mean, they, Credits even had it that they had a, a mental health They're advisor uh, to accurately portray uh, schizophrenia. They're watching her. I'm told that this is actually pretty accurate, so wow, yeah. It's a bit of a long intro. What is she thinking? Uh, oh. I can tell you. She's afraid. Wouldn't you be? Hmm, yeah. You'd think she would get used to it by now after so many years. But the darkness... It just builds onto itself. Growing stronger. Towering over her. You might try and ignore it. Turn away. But it's always there, just out of sight. Where you're most vulnerable. It's like it knows that just enough light is all you need to see its suffocating power. Yeah. Um, what was I talking about again? <laughs> Oh yeah, uh, long intro. It is a long intro. Uh, I've, I've watched some Let's Plays and, you know, only a, a little ways into you the game. You might think she's brave to go on this journey on her own. But it isn't bravery that drives her. Bravery only means something to those afraid of death. Hmm. Said it was fear. Runs far. Far deeper. I would argue that uh, she is brave. Um, bravery is overcoming any fear. It doesn't have to be fear of death, but uh, that's just me. Anyway, uh, I've watched some Let's Plays that have complained about how long this intro is. Personally, I don't care. I'm just marveling how gorgeous it is. And the audio is fantastic. And the motion capture on her face is so pretty. What is she looking at? No one will judge her. No one will ever know. Oh, she heard us. Oh, she gave me chills. There's no going back. You can't do it. Senua pushes away a world that conspired to cause so much suffering. There's nothing to go back to, and worse to look forward to. Why don't you join us? Maybe you too have a part to play in this story. Nice. All right, folks, here we go. Starting Senua's Sacrifice. Hellblade. Okay, so it looks like I can back up. WSD to move. Pull down shift to jog. And there's a marker up ahead. Okay. Use your eyes. Use your eyes. Focus. Come on, closer. She can't focus. Why aren't she looking focus? Closer? Take a closer look. How do I focus? I would like to know how to focus. Oh, it's E. Okay. It's e. Do not forget my story, Senua. Because your darkness comes from hell, and your fate lies there. They say the burning of a corpse will take you straight to Hella's gate. But gods and the living will follow this path. 
He must leave the Isles of Orkney across the Eastern Sea and find a road that leads north and down through deep, dark valleys. After nine oh, nights no, of there. riding, you will follow a great river and will find a bridge covered in gold. The path to Helheim goes from there, across the river of knives that flows from the dark world of Middleheim. Okay. Now I know. Yeah. God, this is coming. Yeah, for life. Hunger for it. Like a pack of wolves in a hunt. She's not stopping. No, she is not. I actually, um... I've seen this part, so I know that, you know, I know, I know what's up ahead. Uh, not this time. Yeah, not this time. But even knowing Jesus. that there was nothing, that was still kind of scary. The land of mist and fog. The old fool was right. Well, I guess he's not an old fool. What was it he said? The river of knives across which lies the halls of hell. Place they call Helheim. He's lost. He's lost. Where are you? Is that his head or a skull? I'm thinking it might be a skull. It's too small to be an entire head. There's no doubt about it. The source of the darkness is in Helheim. And the goddess Hela holds his soul there. Her dear beloved. Dillian. Okay. Okay. So now we get to the plot of the game. She is going into... Uh, basically Viking hell in order to get her uh, slain lover back. Why is she doing this? Yeah, let's jog. Why doesn't um, she turn back? She's doing this for him. She wants to yeah, exactly. She, she's doing it for love. She's doing it for love. His soul still lives. The bridge to Helheim. I forget its name. She forgets too. But she does remember that only the dead may cross it. That part wasn't so easy to forget. Hmm. The old fool said there was a hidden path up to it. Let's see, shall we? Again, if he was right, that makes him not a fool. But whatever. God, this game, it's so pretty. I will say it's kind of annoying that the um, the cursor fights me when I try to look up. It, it, it forces me to look back down. Same thing with looking down, but not quite so much. Um, obviously, I can I have range of motion to look all the way around. Um, God, her face. Oh, it's all so good. Okay, let's let's move on. Oh, right. E. The Northmen speak of nine worlds. The world of men they call Midgard. Sky gods dwell in Asgard. The gods of earth, harvest, wind, and sea dwell in Vanaheim. The good elves dwell in Alfheim. The evil ones dwell in Svartalfheim. The mountain giants Hello. dwell in Jotunheim. The fire giants dwell in Muspelsheim. Niflheim is the world of ice How and darkness. Only the dead dwell in Helheim, and that is where you must travel. Okay, I would love to do that as soon as I figure out how to climb a ladder. Uh, hidden keys? Nothing is happening. Uh, nope. 
Wow. My let's play may end right before it begins, if I can't climb a frickin' ladder. All right, let me uh, just do this real quick. Sorry about this, folks. Uh, controls. Do, do, for, uh, interact. F. Aha. Okay. Let's try F. Yes. There we go. Okay. Oof. <laughs> I mean, I have to say, it's it's great that they decided to go with, um, like, no UI. There's no UI. Uh, I think you can turn on a, a cursor that floats in the middle of the screen uh, for combat. Um, but uh, it's entirely without, like, health meter, without... You know, shut up, I know exactly where I'm going. Um, it's... It's without health meter, it's without stamina meter, or any of that. But yeah. you just shut up, okay? I know what I'm doing. God. Okay. F. There we go. Why did she do that? She shouldn't. Because she can't go to now. <laughs> no, this is it. The hidden path. Scary door, scary door. Glowing scary door. He's going to hurt you. It's dangerous. Don't kill me. I'm not one of them. Don't listen. I was just hiding. I find I live longer that way. Don't listen. I just let the bastards catch me again. Never! Wait. Who are you? You're just a memory. Hmm. Truth? Is that you? Around to you now? Now this is the old place. The tales of the Northmen. They call me Truth. A liar. He's lost. An old fool. <laughs> truth is my truth. Hmm? It's good to see you again. You kept your vow. To guide you. In this life and the next, I will tell you my stories of hell, if I may walk with you. He looks real. He looks like a real person they filmed. Tell me your stories again, old friend. I'm listening. The runes seal the gates to hell. Focus your inner eye, and you too will see what's hidden in plain sight. Focus. You have to take a closer look to see. I can see one. She needs Hold to focus now. She needs to use her okay. Find one like it to open the gate. Now, unfortunately, I, I already know how to do this because I, I watched Let's Plays. Uh, again, only up to a certain point. So I know exactly where to go it's to here. look for it. And it's right here. Focus. You will find it. Look towards the gate. I am so smart. I am so smart. No, I'm not. <laughs> the gate is open. Go through the gate. Go through it. It's dangerous. Uh, F. All oh, right. What's okay. Right. Right. Yep. Where will it take you? It worked. I spent six years enslaved in hell, but I watched the Northmen, learnt their ways. I know you did. You listen? When everyone else laughed. My people pay the heavy price. Carry my stories with you. And together we will make the Northmen feel our fury. Yeah. Fucking Northmen. Um, so I, I, I don't know if you've noticed yet. Um, voice joins us. She once tried to make them go away. Pretend they weren't real. Hmm. But what good is that? When we are always here. I guess it's the same with heights. Topical. You can stand on the edge. Pretend it's going to be okay. But you know that death is near. I don't know how much we'll of that. You to make that. Okay, I am Let's controlling it. Slip. I, 
I wasn't sure how much of that I was controlling, like whether or not she was going to slip off and fall. So I tested it by pushing really hard to the left, and I definitely almost fell. Um, so yeah, I don't know if you've noticed, but uh, Senua and Druth are not Northmen. They are actually uh, Celts. Uh, so I imagine they were attacked, and um, uh, Dillian there on, on her hip uh, uh, fell uh, against them. So. All right, let's focus on this. The world of the dead is ruled by the giantess, Hela, daughter of Loki. The gods feared her bloodline, mm. bad on her mother's side, and yet much worse on her father's. So, as a child, the Allfather cast her down into Helheim and gave her power over those who die of sickness, age, hardship, and self-slaughter. Hmm. In all of the nine worlds, only Hela and resurrect the dead. To Hela, your Dillion was sacrificed. And with her, you must bargain. Well, okay then. On the plus side, uh, Hela definitely has some kick-ass headwear. Uh, look forward to seeing her in uh, the upcoming Thor movie. Thor Ragnarok. Oh, man. I am so excited for that. Uh, we finally get to see... Uh, Hulk talking, which is kind of weird, but the fight begins. Oh, we're gonna get some, get to see some combat now. Look at it. You have to open it. The gate to Helheim divides the living from the dead. Is that the face of Hela herself? The half rotten goddess that walks over Helheim. Ooh, not nearly as pretty as in the movie. Whatever horrors lie behind that door. She must find him. Shh. Someone's here. It's not me, I swear. didn't. Honest. I thank you. Let him go. Oh my god, you were so pretty. I'll give you what you want. I won't resist anymore. Just give him back. <laughs> oh dear. You done fucked up? Oh, that looks like it really hurts. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, oh, here we go. Alright, now, I have no idea what I'm doing, so I'm probably gonna die. Ah! Oh! Oh, I got a kick. Do I have a block? Just I don't have a block. I had a block. What was it? Damn. I'm going to have to check the keys afterwards because I definitely had a block. Let's do the kick again. No, no, I can't. All right. So what was block? I had no. That's a rush. That's a rush. That's a rush forward. No, that's still a rush forward. Ah, damn. All right. I'm gonna kick you. Take that. <laughs> Gotta say, combat is a little simplistic. It's just a lot of spamming left click. What was block? Nope. They're winning. Damn. Yes, I know they're winning. Shut the fuck up. Ah, damn. Damn. Down she goes. This is, by the way, supposed to happen. Oh, 
that looks so painful. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, you poor woman. Oh, damn. Oh, with the eye dilation and everything. A vision of what's to come. Uh huh. Poor Senua. The darkness does not bargain, it does not reason. It is rocked. Mm hmm. And now it has taken hold. It will spread towards her head, the seed of the soul, until there is nothing left of her. Oh, don't scratch. Oh, that's oh, funny. Oh, no. Oh, damn. Oh, that was so nasty. Oh. All of her suffering will have been for nothing. It's just a matter of time. And so this is the part where we're introduced to an interesting game mechanic. The dark rot will grow each time you fail. Yes, thank you, subtitles, because I couldn't read it the first time. If the rot reaches Senua's head, her quest is over. And all progress will be lost. What this means is, every time I die in battle, that black, veiny rot on her arm will creep up further, and if I die too many times, then the game actually deletes my save file forever, and I have to start all over. That is what Dillian taught her. With every defeat, the dark rot will grow, and soon it will take her soul. Yep. But for now, at least, she still has control of her mind. No partial control, I mean, she still and hears she voices. she will fulfill her vow. Whatever the cost. Okay, so this is as far as I've seen. I only uh, watched gameplay video up to this point, so I have no idea what's next. Um, and I'm actually going to cut it after this cutscene here Listen and me, stop for today. The goddess Hela lies behind the gate to Helheim. To open the gate, you must first face the gods that guard it. The god of fire, Surt, and the god of illusion, Valraven. Spill their blood to open the gate to Helheim and enter the land of the dead. Okay. So, yep, yeah, this is uh, where I'm going to stop it for today. Um, but, uh, wow, this game, it is everything I thought it was going to be. Um, everything I saw in the trailers, in the gameplay videos, it's just so gorgeous. I'm really excited to play this further. Uh, I don't know if those voices are going to be, like, a charming addition to the story, or just, like, really freaking annoying. Uh, probably a mix of both, I guess we'll see. But anyway, so I'm going to stop it here and uh, pick it up next time. So uh, this is VC saying, see you later.